everybody, it's your girl, Sugar Bop 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 to the Bop 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 Bop. I know that was unnecessary, but hey, whatever. Today um was a frustrating day because I wanted to film this video earlier today, but I had so much going on that it was just too much to try to fit it in between, so here I am now. By the time you see this video, it will be Thursday, um, so just a little quick thing real quick. If you did not catch my Instagram, if you're not on my Instagram, go ahead and check that out. My name is Sugarbop. You should be able to find me. Um, but just to let you know, I did make a post about my new foundation, because girl, I am stoked. Hold on one second, because this is not... Okay, so as you can see, I found my shade Milani, yes, hunty, and also I've already set my concealer, so I couldn't wait to share that with you guys, because I was just like, oh, ooh. I didn't sh set my concealer on my eyelids yet, but um, that's no problem, y'all know how that go when I be doing that. Um, so, this was supposed to be a full face makeup tutorial, but on account of me coming up short on time, I just went ahead and, um, did my, uh, foundation and my concealer. Um, I do have to do this part of my eyes, though, so, yeah. Um, I was just really excited because I found my, um, my shade. And actually, I'm going to show you what that looks like. Damn, I can't reach back there, but hold on. I actually started using um, Milani just recently. Um, I had found Milani on Target one night. It was a real late night. I was shopping for a birthday gift for somebody, and... I found this one foundation shade. It is called, let's see, it's called Tan. It's um, the Milani, same brand, Milani Conceal Plus Perfect. Um, it's two in one foundation and concealer. Um, I have not used it for concealer yet because I do have my own concealers that I use, as you know, in my other videos. But um, this one is number nine in the color Tan did not work for me because it was too light um I was gonna try to work out work it out a little bit with one of my older um foundations that I had I was gonna try to like deepen it a little bit but I, I went out to Walmart today and girl I found Amber and she's pretty look at this just my shade now, one thing I will say is this, I didn't apply a whole lot on my face, um, so it can be little um, coverage to full face coverage. I didn't put a whole lot on there. As you can see, I got blemishes on my face. You can see them. But the foundation is my shape, so I'm very excited about that. Um, so I'm going to put this back in my basket. Excuse me. I have to show you guys my basket one day. Like, hold on. Let me. I'm. A, so you're not gonna be able to see everything that's in it. This is actually the back of the basket. Let me turn it around. I went out when I was at Walmart as well. I did find these, and I was like, yes, I got to have it. I got to have it. And I found these at Dollar General, and I was like, ooh. Yeah, so I've been using them kind of like sparingly because, you know, I, me personally, when I, um, when I look for like novelty chapsticks, I don't really use it a whole lot. I'm just going for like decoration or like, you know, just to be like, I got it or, you know, sort of like a look type of thing, you know? Um, so let me pull this up. Um, but yeah, so... I found all of these. 
I probably will not use all of them. I probably will give maybe like two to three away and then keep the rest of them because I do have I'm gonna mess up my basket. I'm gonna be so mad, but that's okay, I can fix it. I do have these as well. This is turning into a makeup haul video. Like this is crazy, but I have to show you guys this. Like I'm too pumped, okay? So this was um part of Eminem's uh Lip Smokers Christmas collection. Um only got it for two dollars because I shot um the after Christmas sale. I wish I can get this open. Oh, there we go. I shopped the after Christmas sale, so I got like four of them. So it was only two bucks. Crazy thing though, I when I was at Walmart earlier today, I did see all the colors in like the package like this. But I was like, since I already have these four, I'm just gonna go ahead and get you know something different. Um, so. Yeah, I'm I'm pumped about them. I'm pumped. Um, so I do need to get my eyeshadow palette out. And I'm going to be using, and I know it's like, okay with the Profusion already, but I cannot stress enough how much Profusion means to me. Like, Profusion is life. I didn't get to use my Sultry palette yet on camera, so I will be doing that today. Um, like I said, I and I truly apologize. It's just, you know, I wanted to do a full face thing, but I ran out of time today. And I very well could have just did it tomorrow, but I would like to have this out for you guys because tomorrow, come to think of it now, no, I couldn't have because I have things going on again tomorrow. And it's just going to be a very big distraction with that, so... I'm just going to film this tonight, and tomorrow I'm going to um, have it posted. I'm going to edit tonight as well, and then post this video tomorrow, um, hopefully early morning. Well, maybe not early morning, maybe like 11. I'm not going to say your time, but I am going to have it out tomorrow, okay? Uh, which will be Thursday when you see this video, like I said. So I'm going to go ahead and get my eyeshadow palette out because I haven't talked your head off enough. I know. Um, let me move this out the way. And what did I say I was doing? Oh, my sultry eyeshadow palette. <sighs> I have to rearrange my basket now. This is crazy. Because I have all my big eyeshadow palettes at the bottom of the basket. Um, so, yeah, it's, yeah. No explanation, it's just that it fits better if it's at the bottom of the basket. And I'm rambling on again. I truly do apologize. I'm so sorry. Alright, but I'm going to get on to it, I promise. Also, I'm going to use my um, highlighter palette as well that I have from Profusion. Um, I have not used that on camera yet, so I'm going to do that as well. So you can get somewhat of a full face type of feel, you know, minus me doing my foundation. Okay. I got so much crap on top of these foundation, um, foundation, Lord. I got things on top of these eyeshadow palettes. It's crazy. So... I got my Sultry palette right here, and I have used this a few times, but, hmm. I lied to you not. I like this one, but I think out of both of the Profusion palettes, I think I like the Sienna more. Because the colors are much brighter in the Sienna palette. So, not to say anything wrong about this, because I do like this one too. To be honest with you, when I saw this, the thing that grabbed me the most was the, um, the green shades. You know what I'm saying? You see them? That's what grabbed me the most. That and this pretty um, color is called Ecstasy. So, yeah. I'm, like last time, I don't have a idea in my head for how I want this to look. I'm just, you know, going to 
go with the flow and see what I come up with, basically. So I'm just going to stick that there. Highlighter palette. And this is Pro Fusion as well. This is actually a highlighter and contouring kit. And I saw this and I was like, yes. That gold color, oh my god, yes, Tante. It's This is going to be beautiful. It's just going to be great. And, you know, like I said earlier, my day was going really bad. But when I found that foundation, oh, oh, things got better. Things got better for the better. All right, let's get on to it. Um, so you've seen my makeup brushes before. Um... You've seen my makeup brushes before, so I'm just going to get on with it, okay? Because I think I talked your head off enough. And you're probably like, okay, this is another makeup review type of video. <laughs> and it's not like that, I promise. I promise. Um, so, like I said, I do need to do my concealer on my eyelid so that colors will pop but you know what I'm gonna try something different and no I'm not gonna do that because you know what the last time I did a spritz on my eyeshadow brushes and dipped it in the eyeshadow it it was a hot mess the eyeshadow got wet and you remember that if you saw my last makeup tutorial so you'll understand where I'm coming from with that um so I'm going to get on to it. I'm actually just going to go ahead and put the Milani on my eyelids as well. Instead of doing the regular um, concealer that I usually use. Because I think this is totally, like, so much easier. I got foundation on the thing already. I think this is much easier. That way I could just pat it on my eyelids instead of trying to, like, paint it on. So, I'm going to get to it. I promise y'all. Alright, so... Close that for a second. I'm just gonna go ahead and usually I put it on a brush and brush it and then just pat it down. But I'm just gonna go ahead and with my trusty dusty. See that? You see it? Oh, ooh. And I hope I did not just mess up my concealer when I did that. Because I low-key felt like I did. And, yeah, I had a look going, y'all. I'm telling you, I, I popped that foundation on. Then I did the concealer, and I was just too much. Okay? Yeah, I feel like I messed up my concealer now, and I'm low-key mad. Low-key mad. Alright, so that's good. Since I'm using it as concealer, I just need to pat it on a little bit. Um, but now I know what foundation to get and what my shade is, and I'm so, so happy. And the good thing about Milani, too, is it's very cheap. This foundation, believe it or not, was only $8.97 at Walmart. And it, like I said, it, it's the bomb, y'all. When I found it, I was like, ooh. Ooh! Knock this stuff down. Ooh. Okay, so... Put that on the side. I need to wash my brushes too, by the way. Because my this one brush has low-key been sitting on the dresser for like a whole week with foundation on it. And this was, yeah, a whole week. Because this was when I found um, that tan color of Milani foundation. So, yeah. I'm just going to lay it on here because, yeah. I need to wash the other ones anyway, so that's cool. Um, so I'm just going to... Where is my spritz? Alright, so got my trusty dusty elf. Oh, camera's right here. Trusty dusty elf. 
All right, and I'm just going to go ahead and spritz my face. And, you know, like I said in the previous video, I always just spritz my face first before I do my eyeshadow. Um, on account of, I don't know, that's just how I do things, you know. Oh, and wait till we get to the lipstick, because I found this other lipstick at Target the same night I found that Milani um, foundation. Oh, wait till you see it, boo. I hope it comes through. I'll wait till you see it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and spray my face. Okay. Just a little bit. <coughs> Excuse me. Just a little bit. Just a, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just, just a little bit. Hey. Okay, I'm done. I'm done being goofy. <laughs> <coughs> um, so... I'm going to use this brush. I do have an eyeshadow brush though. So I'm going to use this one. Oh, this one. This is my elf brush. I know you can't see it, but yeah. And then this is one of my little makeup brushes. You've seen this in the last video too. Five below. I uh, got, I had got the four piece for $5. And this works just as well as them expensive makeup brushes, believe it or not. So you don't have to spend a whole lot of money to, you know, get results with your makeup. As far as makeup brushes and things like that. And the same thing goes with the foundations and, you know, because this is living proof right here that, you know, $9 foundation is where it's at. Um, and eyeshadows as well. It's the same thing, you know. You don't have to spend a whole lot of money on makeup to actually get your face to look nice, you know. $10 eyeshadow palette from Profi Profusion, and they did that. So, I don't know what else to say other than, you know, if you're balling on a budget, it's fine because you still want to look good anyway. All right, I'm going to it. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to use this one, I think, for my tear duct. So let me hold off on that. I'm also going to need my highlighter too. And I, you know what? I think I could use this for that. Oh, this could be a, that's a more like a powder brush, but no, wait a minute. I'm lying. I can use that for my contour. All right, so I'll just set that there. Going with my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. Um, and what color do I want to go in with first? So I think I'm going to do that really dark blue lagoon for my transition color, and I'm going to try to show you. Um, you guys know how awkward I am with these, this webcam, and I was just taking this out because, like I said in the previous video, Profusion gives you this fancy makeup brush, and I am going to use it one day. I just, I want to savor it for the right time. It's so soft and so pretty. I don't want to use it just yet. All right, so you see Lagoon? I'm going to point it out. Lagoon is this color right here. See my finger? Oh, wait. It's right there. Sorry. That's Lagoon. Now, you guys, I cannot wait to show you this lipstick. It's a dark green. They call it Jade. And it is so pretty. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Dark Lagoon, and that's going to be my transition color. Just going to tap it a little, because, you know, it would be pretty, you know, or whatever, if I got too much, but I don't want to do that, you know, so I'm just going to go ahead and stop talking, y'all. Oh, you see how that's showing up? It's pretty, right? Mm. 
And this is a technique I learned on YouTube, as a matter of fact, on how to get it to show up pretty nice. Mm, 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 that blue is pretty. And I find when I do, oh, it looks a little messed up, but that's okay. I find when I do that motion, it just makes the colors look so pretty. Like, it really comes out, y'all. It really comes out. So, um, I'm not going to use this one, this pink one yet. I do have another eyeshadow brush I can use. I'm going to use the other elf one. Then I'm going to go in with this because I kind of need that for my tear duct. So instead of doing like four different colors on my lid, I'm just going to do the dark blue lagoon. And then I'm going to do another shade like right here. Blend it out. Then I'm going to do my tear duct. Then I should do, I'm going to do my under eye since I did do concealer this time for my under eye and it's gonna look pretty y'all I promise all right so what am I going to do I went in with Lagoon so now I'm gonna go in with that that light green called Jealousy you see it let me see it's this one right here and it's so pretty and I've used these shades already a few times so it's like you know, I kind of know my way around this eyeshadow palette, but I haven't, like, technically used all the colors yet. So, you know. Anyway, let's get to it. And like I said, you guys, I'm going to blend it out, so... It's going to look pretty. And the reason why I did the light green is because I want you guys to actually be able to see it. Instead of using that dark green, that's what that's called. It's called thrash. But I want you guys to be able to see that light green. So I'm going to put some more. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, you see it? Ew. <laughs> I'm so funny. I low key want to buy this eyeshadow palette again, but I'll have to buy it online this time because this is sold out in the store. And they say Target sells Profusion, but when I went in there, I did not see one item. So, yeah. Um, not coming for Profusion's life, but I was a little disappointed because that's really why I went in there. Because I was going to get one of these eyeshadow palettes for, you know, the person I was getting a birthday gift for. But they didn't have it, so I was, like, kind of mad. So I had to kind of, like, pick up stuff as I went. Because I was like, ooh, this would be really pretty, you know, it's 21 shades. And she's going to like this. You know, but they didn't have it. So, I had to buy it on the Profusion website for now on. Um, I did happen to see another, um, one more Sienna palette left, but I already have that. And, yeah, I should have just went to Walmart. That's what I should have did, but I was being lazy. So, I mean, technically, I still could have because Walmart was like, Maybe I might let you down the road further, but I was, like I said, I was being lazy, so I didn't. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get, what did I do with my blending brush? I know, dang on wow, I picked it up. I'm going to put this in there. Um, I know I picked up a blending brush. What is that? Oh, here it is. My um, elf blending brush. And I'm just going to blend it out just a little bit. Even though I think it looks good, like how it is. And you can see the blue really good. You know what? I don't need to blend this. Because you know what? I think it looks great. Just the way it is. So. You see that blue? You see it? Yeah, baby. Alright. <laughs> Alright. So I'm going to go in with this brush for my tear duct. My pink brush. Like pink and blue. I guess you could say like ombre color. Anyway, I'm going to get on to it. 
So for my tear duck, I'm going to do, 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 do. I think I want to go in with aesthetic. It's that pretty color down there. I'm going to go in with that instead of doing like a gold. Because like I said, I am going to do a contour this time um, on my face. And it's going to come together, y'all. It's going to come together. So I'm going to go ahead and do my tear duct. And this is so pretty. I like this color. I have not used this color yet. But it looks really, really pretty. So I'm going to get on to it. Here we go. Tear duct. Tear duck style. Oh, and that looks really good. You see it? Oh, wait. Wrong eye. You see it? Hey, It came through. Came through. Came through like, what's your popping, boo? Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Mmm. That is so pretty. I low-key feel like I should have did a little bit of concealer right there. But this is pretty enough. I think it looks good. Just like this. I probably... I think, though, like, it's pretty. But I probably... Well, next time, go in with that gold color. Instead of going in with... Oops. I don't want to mess my eye up. So I better stop rubbing my face like that. Yeah, so... I think that's pretty. So, like I said, I should have used a little bit of concealer right there. But that's okay. I think it looked good. Look, I think it looked good. I think it looks good. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, so, you know what? I want to do an under eye because, like I said, I did do... um concealer so I'm gonna go in with my I think I'm just gonna go in with this little brush right here this brush came in my hard candy eyeshadow palette and I've only used it for my under eye for the simple fact that I think it's just the perfect size you know and you know too I can do I um makeup look with my hard candy eyeshadow palette as well. I just happen to think that I need to play with these a little bit more and because I want to play with these a little more. It's just so many colors. I'm in love with bright colors. And ask anybody that knows me personally, they will tell you I'm in love with bright colors. Because you know, being, you know, my skin tone or whatever. I feel as though dark colors don't really show up on my face that well. Unless, of course, now I know the technique, put concealer on, and, you know, it'll look good. So, you know, I might try dark colors now, as far as, like, chocolate colors and things like that. Because, Hanty, this dark blue right here is shining through. You see it? And look at my tear duck. Oh, ooh, yes. Okay, I'm getting to it. So for my under eye, ooh, oh, I almost dropped my thing and I almost ruined it. All right, so for my under eye, I'm going to go in with. Dum, 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 dum. I low key want to go in with this pretty blue color that's called Ella. You see it? It's right there. But I don't know how that would look. Like, I don't want to be doing way too much. You know what I'm saying? Even though it's my face. Or whatever, but like, I think that, I don't think that would go well with the color scheme that I got going on. So I'm not going to go with that. I'm going to go in with, I'm going to go in with that Three Wishes. So you see, it? this is Three Wishes right here. It is so pretty. And it's really not showing up on camera that well, but like, this is a webcam, like I always say. So, um, yeah. Three Wishes is going to go in my under eye. I can tell you how I feel about you night and day. Oh, you see it? That gold? Yeah. But like, 
more story times are coming by the way um i will be filming some of those because i have a bunch of ideas and i have a lot of stories to tell you guys all right here we go three wishes is going in this eye yes buddy <laughs> yeah Three wishes. Yes, yes. Oh, I already connected. Never mind. I don't need to do that. Either. Okay. So I'm just going to stop with that one. And that is so far what I'm using for the Sultry Eyeshadow Palette. Um, I will be using this again in a pre um, preview. In another video. So stay tuned for that. Um, so let me get on with my highlighter. And do do do. And if you hear people in the background, my bad. Um, I don't know why the ring's so loud. But I'm gonna go in with. Do 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 do. I think I'm gonna go in with heartfelt. This heartfelt right here, it's really like a light, it's a light pink, but you're not going to be able to see it. I can't wait till I get a, a camera camera, like a Canon or something, because I can't be using this webcam too much longer. Either that or get better lighting. Like, I've, you know, I've got this little gadget, and I think it helps to a certain extent, but I need better lighting and I need a camera, like a real camera, with like a tripod or something. I don't know. Anyway, thank you for continuing to view my videos, giving thumbs up, and things like that. Even though it's not a whole lot, you know, so what? You know, I don't really do it for the likes and things like that. I do it because it's therapeutic to me. This is what I want to do. You know, it's you know, something that makes me feel good. And, you know, so I low-key feel like I'm in the makeup now and, you know, I'm trying different things. So, you know, why not just do it on camera, you know? And if, you know, just do it on camera. I feel like makeup is the only, like, I feel like, if I'm going to put makeup on, I would like to do it in front of the camera so that, you know, not to teach people how to do it, but like show them how I do it. And because, I mean, I just think it's fun. It's something fun for me to do, you know, something fun for me to do. All right. And so, like I said, I'm going out with Heartfelt. That's my, um, my uh, highlighter I'm going to go in with. And I'm just going to, hmm, okay, now I remember why I don't use this much, because it doesn't really, all right, let's see, so I'm going to go, oh, that's too much, that's too much, yes, Jesus, that's too much, so, yeah, I probably should have used a different color because this highlighter is like should pop in everywhere. And it's pretty, but it's too much. So let me do like this. Use my other brush I have right here and maybe try to brush some of that off without messing up my foundation. Okay, that looks a little bit better. And I can do a contour. Oh, yeah, that looks a little bit better. Yes, I like that. I like that a whole lot better now. Yes, and it goes with my under eye as well. So, um, yeah, I've dusted some off, so I think it looks better now. And that highlight is just like sugar glowing, boo boo. And I low key feel like I want to do a contour too, but I'll make that for another video. Okay, you guys, I'll make that for another video. You know, you know what? No, I'm not going to do that to y'all. This is a full face, so I had already did the foundation, so let's get on with the um, contour, okay? I'm going to go ahead and go on with this. 
And I'm gonna do, 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 do. I'm gonna do the bait column right here. You see it? All right, there you go. It's called bait. I'm gonna go ahead and go in and put that on my cheek. Not my cheek. Yeah, my cheek. And I don't really do contour like that. So this is something new to me. So I'm just going to go ahead and go with it, boo. Just go with it. Oh! And it's called Bake, like I said. So, oh! Yes. I think this goes really well on my skin. It looks, oh! I like how this looks. Yes. This is so pretty. I could probably do like my forehead too, but I'm not going to go that far. Because I ain't bold like that. Not yet. <laughs> um, so, moving on to this lipstick that I can't wait to show y'all. Oh my god, this thing is powerful. And it's going to, come and think of it now. It's going to go with that blue and green eyeshadow that I got. So, hold up. And like I say in every video, if you have not seen the What's in My Makeup bag yet. And you want to see what's in there. Go ahead, feel free. That was like one of the very first makeup videos that I did um that was actually that actually was the very first makeup video I did that was the so I did if you know you're new to my channel hold on because I feel like this is just okay that's better so um I did an introduction video and then I did a what's in my makeup bag video after that Introduction video was pretty short. It was just basically letting you guys know I'm new to YouTube. You know, I'm going to be making videos at least once a week. Um, once my schedule gets less hectic, I'm going to try to do at least two videos a week. Um, but I can't really make promises. Um, I do want to do at least two videos a week. Maybe like film one video or, you know... Because I'm off Wednesdays and Thursdays. So maybe film one video, edit, post on Wednesday. Then Thursday, film another one, edit, post. Blase, blase. You get the picture, right? I know. Alright, so I'm talking too much again. Here we go. So this color is called Smoky Jade. And this is by Maybelline. It's number 706. And it's so pretty. Like, you see it? It is so pretty. This low-key gives me Rihanna vibes, like that lipstick that she has with her Fenty line. I think her lipstick is a little bit lighter, though. But this right here is very pretty. And it smells like vanilla. Mmm, yes. You did that, Maybelline. You did that, girl. Yeah, it smells like vanilla. I like it. Um, so, I have not reached my uh stage where i've started wearing very expensive makeup yet because like i said i'm balling on a budget you know um i got a one job and that's it you know and that's about it so all right let me get ahead with this lipstick now the first time i put this on it low-key looked like that dark blue lipstick that i have and I very well could have put that on, but like I said, that dark blue lipstick makes your lips really dry. Um, but if you want to see that dark lipstick that I'm talking about, um, I showed it in my What's in My Makeup Bag video. Bag. Mm. What's in My Makeup Bag video. It's a liquid one, and it's um, a matte one like this. This, I don't think it's matte though, because... This right here happens to come on really smooth and it looks really pretty and it's like, it's got a creamy texture to it. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I think I'm going to put a little bit of chapstick on my lips though. So, what am I doing with my big chest? Oh, right in front of my face. Lord have mercy, you know. So, this is one of my big chapsticks that I have, Fountain Dew. This is the other one, Lucky Charms. Everybody who knows me knows Lucky Charms is my favorite cereal. And I got a Trix one too. So, I'm just going to pop this on really quick on my lips. Okay, so, excuse me y'all. 
Um, my lips feel a little dry, but that's okay. I got my lipstick right here. I'm just going to go ahead and apply because like I said, this joint is smooth like butter. You see that? Yes, hunty. One thing I will say, I'm not the expert lipstick putter on her, if that makes sense. I know that's not a real word, putter on her, but... Yeah. So this is the Jade Lipstick. I love it. Did I get on my teeth? Oh, why right, we good. I love it. Um. So yeah. See if you can get. It. See that? It is so pretty. I actually think this looks better than that dark blue lipstick that I had on. Um, in my Instagram video, I, that's what I meant to say. If you wanted to see me with my dark blue lipstick on, go ahead and check out my Instagram. Um. I will try to put that link in the description box. If not, just, you know, look me up, Sugarbot. That's my name on Instagram. So, yeah. Um, so, that's going to be it for this full face makeup tutorial. I hope you guys like this and be on the lookout for more full face makeup tutorials. Because, like I said, I can't wait to play with them eyeshadow palettes. Boy, I cannot wait. They got some pretty colors in that thing. And yeah, so. And I'm hoping to be able to get more eyeshadow palettes as well. Um, not just use the same two all the time. Um, I want to get the big ones like that. So like I said, I will be shopping on Profusion's website. Um, to My hair is so messed up right now. To get, um, you know, more eyeshadow palettes from them. Um, next makeup video might be the, um, Hard Candy Eyeshadow Palette one. Um, get more of those two, because they do have, like, I think it's like two other ones that they have. So, oh, wait, you guys. I forgot my mascara. And I'm just going to put on a little bit on because this is going to come right off my face when I'm done because it's late and yeah, it's late. Like I said, I ran out of time today, but I did want to go ahead and film this video on account of, you know, um, I wanted to get something out to you guys. So thank you so much for, you know, viewing my channel. And I forgot to say it in the beginning, if you're not a sugar bear and you would like to be a sugar bear, go ahead and subscribe today. Hit that notification bell so you know when I post a video because I'm sugar bot. So you can be my sugar bear, okay? Become a part of the sugar bear family. Like, what is you doing? You know you want to. Go ahead. It's free, boo. It's free. All right? So I love everybody. Don't forget, you have to enjoy life, because if you don't enjoy life, oh my goodness, what are you going to do? Enjoy life. <laughs> All right, I love you guys. Mwah.